good morning. Oh, I've got a tickle. <coughs> oh, that's bad timing. Um, so it's Sunday morning here in Tunisia. I've got here Friday afternoon. Um, and today I've got a trip that I booked before I got here um, to the El Gem Coliseum. Hi, so we made it to El Gem. It's absolutely stunning, look. Although well, I don't let that sunshine fall you, it's still really chilly. But then I guess that's February, isn't it? in the middle the the strip part is actually wire mesh and this was put in to allow ventilation and light to the underneath part where the gladiators and the animals have been waiting and then we have where those boys are standing actually there's a square and there's another one in the middle of that great school party and they're the openings where the animals would have been lifted up by slaves ready for the fight so I'm just going to go downstairs now to where the gladiators and animals would have waited. So, I assume we're allowed down here. There's no, nothing to say you can't. That's quite low. So if you're a bit tall, watch your head. Even I'm having to duck at five foot four. So this part here, there are a few electric lights, but I would imagine back in the day, if you were a gladiator waiting down here, it would have been really pretty dark and very scary, actually. Now, I'm not going to be able to walk down this part because there's a gate by the looks of it, but you can just see that's that strip that I showed you in the middle of <laughs> the children that was put in to allow the light and ventilation. So that does make this part quite light. And then... Do you know what, I'm going, it's just one little gate. These would be the rooms, I guess, where animals and gladiators would wait. A little bit for natural sunlight there. And these would be the rooms where they would wait to find their fight. Really good, really. I'm just looking to see if I can find one of the ones with the things where the... Yeah, there we are. There we go. So, this is what I was looking for. So this is where the animals would have been lifted manually by slaves up into the amphitheatre. I don't really think I'm supposed to be in this bit, so I'll step back onto the actual path. Oh no, there's others doing the same as me. This is a nice place for a drink on a snack. see where next. I figure I might try and get over to this part. I've not been up there yet. Um, and then time to head back to the coach ready for the next part which is I think a museum. Let's see where we go. Coach now. Hopefully I don't get lost. 
little town right now. So just at um, the Roman Museum, just across from the amphitheatre, it's just a little snapshot. Huge mosaics. Like this one is the full length of the wall. Just amazing. There's a rebuilt Roman villa, there's lots of mosaics. And this is a follow-on from the trip to the Colosseum. It's all part of the same trip. Very, very worthwhile doing. Oh, look at the size of that. And the detail. 